Hi guys, what's up? Toba Loco here, doing another FIFA World Cup video. This time, I've replaced all the teams with one star teams and half star teams. Now, obviously, again, I need to state that the squads are out of date, but I don't think it matters with these teams. Um, so yeah, let's just jump straight into it. Uh, I'm controlling Sitkits and Nevis uh, of the Caribbean. Um, the groups obviously are random, uh, the, the the game just put them in there, it doesn't really matter, they're all rated the same, let's just jump into it and see who would win a one star nation world cup. Right, okay so the first match is against Comoros, we're in group A so that means all the matches I do, do now would be um, first, pretty much anyway, I mean... Okay, did I win that match? Did they win? Uh, no, nope, lost 2-0 against Comoros. Let's have a look and see what the group stages are like. Okay, so you got Comoros and Vietnam with Luxembourg and St. Kitts and Nevis. Dead last, that's me. Um, Solomon Islands and Bermuda. Uh, Madagascar and the Seychelles and Kyrgyzstan. All got points there. Curacao, San Marino actually got some points, I presume, against New Caledonia. Uh, Timor Leste, Hong Kong, and all that lot have still got a play, so we just got to we just got to um, simulate those again. Um, I mean, if you know any other shit teams, then that's fine. But these are the worst teams, like arguably in the world. Like, okay, like you could say, what about Azerbaijan? What about like you know? But these are bad teams. I mean, maybe the Faroe Islands, I would give them a little bit of credit because they beat Greece once. But these are some of the teams that you never, ever see in qualification, ever, apart from San Marino because they're always in there. All right, so we'll, um, we'll do this match. Did I win that one? No, I lost 2-1. They lost 2-1. Um, Simulate to that date, so then we got the full group there. So that we're pretty much out at this point, but it doesn't matter. Okay, so um, uh, Luxembourg, Vietnam look like going through. Comoros look like they're about could squeeze in. Bermuda, I put their place in the round of sixteen. Madagascar and the Seychelles, um, Curacao, uh, New Caledonia, um. San Marino, three points. Hong Kong with six points. They're through pretty much, I think. Uh, Ferrar Islands, yeah, they're through. Uh, US Virgin Islands and St. Vincent Grenadines also through Somalia. Not doing as well as they sh probably should have done. And Gambia and Andorra and Liechtenstein still hanging on. Um, of course, there's still games to play. There's still one more game. Um, right, let's have a look. Let's see what we got. Okay, out. Sim, rest of the tournament. This is going to be interesting. Who's going to win the World Cup? You can't be serious. Bermuda won the World Cup. Of a one-star nation. Despite Andorra being in there. Despite Luxembourg being in there. You know, you know you'd know, you arguably say that those people do play for decent English sides. German sides. You know, probably in like League 2, League 1 sort of thing. But Bermuda come out on top. Let's see how they got there. Okay, so obviously they won 5-4 on penalties. What a thrilling final. 3-3. Three, three. Oh my god. Okay, who came third? Uh, Hong Kong came third over Gambia. Wow, that's uh, that's really, really bizarre. Um, okay, uh, semi-finals. Bermuda beat Gambia 3-1. Uh, Luxembourg beat Hong Kong 4-0 as well in the semi-finals. Not bad at all. Um, Bermuda beat Curacao um, 3-0. And uh, Gambia obviously beat Faroe Islands on penalties. Um, Hong Kong beat St. Vincent the Grenadines. And then Luxembourg beat Madagascar uh, on penalties. Uh, so quite a tight game there. Okay, so you've got round of 16. Faroe Islands beat US Virgin Islands. Uh, 2-0. Uh, Gambia and Montserrat obviously went to penalties. It was 2-2, obviously, in that game. Pretty pretty decent game there. Uh, what have we got here? Uh, St. Vincent in the Grenadines beat Eritrea 3-0. Uh, Hong Kong beat Liechtenstein 2-1. Uh, Bermuda beat Comoros 1-0. 
squeeze their way past that one. Um, uh, Kokal beat, I hope I'm saying that right by the way, uh, beat Kyrgyzstan 1-0. Um, and then the round of 16 again, you've got Madagascar beating New Caledonia 3-2. And then Luxembourg beating the Cayman Islands 4-1 to make that the World Cup. The one-star World Cup, should I say. Okay, let's uh, simulate. So, obviously, you got Bermuda. I don't know if these players are real or not. <laughs> it's really interesting. But, um, yeah, you, Bermuda are the one-star World Cup champions. Um, yeah, I mean, make what you will of that one. But um, hopefully we can see the... Uh... Okay, so that's what the group stage just looked like. Um Andorra getting knocked out, that's quite surprising considering Andorra are actually not a horrible side. Like, they do score some pretty decent goals sometimes, I've seen in European qualification. They do get battered, but they score good goals. And I think you know, against one star teams, they would definitely go the, go the distance, but obviously not. Um, okay, so that's what it looks like. Um, lots and lots of penalty shootouts, um, at least like three, four, um, so yeah, I mean, incredible, incredible stuff really, I mean, Bermuda are your world one star champions, um, so yeah, if you like that video, then please leave a like, comment, say who you think should win the one star world cup in your opinion, uh, obviously this is just a game and a simulation, um, please subscribe if you like my content, and the next video potentially would be a two-star World Cup. So, yeah, look out for that one, I guess. The best of two-star nations and then probably do three-star. Uh, four-star, probably not. Um, actually, no, I will do a four-star, but definitely not five-star <laughs> because there's not many five-star teams in the world. Not 32, anyway. Anyway, this has been Tobaloka. Thanks for watching.